Legend and international recording superstar Sarah Brightman is the original Christine from the Phantom of the Opera. She is also the world's best selling soprano, selling 30 million records and achieving more than 1 billion streams. And now she's coming to Australia. Since belting out Andrew Lloyd Webber's iconic hits in the West End and on Broadway, Sarah Brightman has represented the pinnacle of music on the live stage. She topped the charts with Andrea Bocelli and performed the theme song. Sarah was awarded a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame last year and this morning big news she's coming to Australia to star in a lavish new production of Lloyd Webber's Tony Award winning musical masterpiece Sunset Boulevard. Yes everything's as if we never said goodbye. Sarah will play the legendary silent movie star Norma Desmond, a role made famous by Glenn Close and inspired by the classic film. All right, Mr. DeMille, I'm ready for my close-up. Sunset Boulevard marks Sarah's first theatrical role in more than three decades. And Sarah Brightman joins me now from London. A very good morning to you. Sarah, it's that famous line from Sunset Boulevard, I'm ready for my close-up. Are you ready for your close-up with this show on the other side of the world right here in Australia? Well, I'm trying. As you can see, I'm I'm getting into the part and the role, <laughs> seeing it's it's breakfast time <laughs> or brekkie time. But uh, no, it's it's it was wonderful to be asked to do this. And um, really, in a nutshell, um, I haven't. I don't think I've been uh, doing a musical for about three decades now. So it's it's going to be very very exciting. Music by Andrew Lloyd Webber, of course. So what do you think it is about his music that continues to draw audiences decades on right across the globe global appeal he's just very good at what he does um, and he's he's very passionate about his work and I I have to say as time's gone on just sort of watching him and seeing how he arranges and puts together all the pieces that he he does and the newer pieces he actually gets better and stronger and more knowledgeable Sarah, you've had some incredible career milestones. We don't have time to go through all of them, but this month marks the 27th anniversary of Phantom of the Opera on the West End. And you were the original Christine. What are your memories of that? And, and how much did Phantom change your life? Um, I mean, it was amazing. It was amazing being original part of Cats and then being a muse and the performing Christine in The Phantom of the Opera. I mean, it was in a way kind of slightly life, art imitating life for me at that time. I was a young, very young woman. I was starting in my career in this, in this way and sort of also doing all my training with my classical music. So it... I can't remember huge amounts about it, but it really, really changed my life and gave me wonderful opportunities, which hopefully I've, I've done a lot with in my life and, and given as much as I could. So much with. I mean, we all remember your iconic performance at the Barcelona Olympics. What are your, what are your memories from, from that moment and, and how does that rank in your you know, list of achievements? Well, funnily enough, the Barcelona, as, as exciting as it was, I, I nearly nearly missed my cue because somebody told uh, myself and Jose Carreras that we had to get down this huge staircase in like a matter of seconds and we dashed down and were completely out of breath at the bottom. <laughs> so that that is my memory of that. <laughs> but it was fun doing it in China as well because um, I did the opening... Um, of the Olympics in China. And that, that was a bit of a milestone for me. That was an incredible experience as well. Of course, Sarah, there's the West End, there's Broadway, but here in Australia, we have this love of, of musicals on the stage. Do you feel that when you're on stage here, how much Aussie audiences just love these big productions? 
Do you know, I love coming to Australia and performing because, you know, when, I, when I'm able and, and when I do, because it has a wonderful history of people really enjoying and, and the culture of music. Um, and uh, actually, when I was asked to do this part and I was told it was going to be in Australia, I thought, what better place than to do this, which I haven't done for so long in that beautiful country. So it's, it's very, very, it's very exciting for me. Well, we have no doubt you will get such a warm reception from audiences here. Sarah Brightman, thank you so much for your time. And please come and see us in studio here when you're in Australia. Thank you. Thank you so much. What a delight. Sunset Boulevard premieres at Melbourne's Princess Theatre in May, ahead of its season at the Sydney Opera House in August. You'll find all the ticket details at sunrise.com.au. A chance to see a legend on stage.